earn your divisions. First, we're going to roll the virtual dice to see how many times we randomize. If we roll snake eyes, it would have fought to three times in the random. This break, let's randomize everything nine times, six, three, nine. All right, 11 divisions, as always, for this, these divisional breaks. Let's go nine times for your 11 divisions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Men's welterweight division down to the men's light heavyweight division nine times. You know what's funny? Um, so I just got that brand new UFC 5 game, by the way. Um, so what I like to do just like for fun every year is um, they allow you to do open weight fights. So you could put like a heavyweight against a bantamweight. Um, <laughs> so I was was crazy is that I put the bantamweight champion, right? Um, against the heavyweight champion, John Jones. And John Jones actually got tapped out. I'm like, what? Against Brandon Moreno. <laughs> I'm like, what? Usually the heavyweights knock out the little guys like super fast, but like Brandon Moreno actually took him to the ground and then ended up submitting him like towards the end of like the, I think the first or second round. All right, let's go nine times for your names. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven eight and nine you got dg cool down to um george t nine times all right here are your divisions everybody i'll give you a few minutes to trade and then we'll get right into it because they're both trash.
All right, guys and girls, UFC time. What's going on, everybody? This is Connor from MojoBray.com here for Sunday night, November 26, 2023, doing another four hobby boxes of 2023 Donruss Opt Optic UFC. This is our last four boxes, random weight divisions number seven. Just drew your teams. There were no – or drew your divisions. There were no trades. Let's get it. All right, we got a bunch of spots coming in here. Let me update you guys on what's still coming up here next. We got a lot of breaks going down tonight still. A lot of really good breaks on tonight's schedule. Obviously, we got that big triple case at the end of the night at the museum. Um, NT College is about to sell out soon here. There's only seven left now. Rams are gone. Let's see. Raptors gone from NT Basketball. NT Basketball is down to 19. We got Mike grabbing the Pirates in the triple case. 17 left in the triple case of museum collection. Um, random numbers NT. Obviously, we still got that one to fill up. Only 39 left now out of 99 total spots. We got the Suns gone in NT basketball. 18 left in NT basketball. Museum collection six box random number three has only 16 left as well. And then we got Kevin from vacation grabbing three NT teams. <laughs> 15 left. Good luck, uh, Kevin. Kevin. 15 teams left in National Treasures and two Breaker Delight teams. 13 left in Breaker's Delight. All right, so there is our updated schedule right there. We are breaking UFC right now. Seven left in that NT College, guys. Again, go check out the prices in, those NT, in that NT College break. Price to move, price to go. Two more NT teams, Kevin says. 13 teams left in National Treasures. Also, our last case of definitive is tonight, too. That one still has uh, 12 teams left. Last case of definitive. Dolphins gone from NT College. Six teams left in National Treasures College. Six teams left. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Box one. Good luck to everybody. Any refractors will be top loaded for you. Here's a Silver Hollow Jake Matthews, rated rookie for the men's welterweight division. Dominators, Pot Prospect Bo Nickel. 
Ro Paul Rosas, another hot prospect. Pink Velocity, Miranda Maverick for the women's flyweight division, 65 out of 79. Pink Velocity, Miranda Maverick. My House, Conor McGregor for the men's featherweight division. Silver Hollow, Derek Brunson, men's middleweight division. First auto of the break, a 15 out of 99 Iceman Chuck Liddell Optographs Blue Hollow. Men's light heavyweight division. Men's light heavyweight, George. Iceman Chuck Liddell. Light it up, Izzy Adesanya. Jerry Parshaka. Orange Hollow of Yun for the men's light heavyweight division. 34 out of 49, Orange Hollow. And bonus auto, Silver Hollow, Stephanie Eder. Women's Bantamweight division, Silver Hollow. Bonus hit, Women's Bantamweight. Women's Bantamweight, Featherweight combo, Allen. Edgar. Volkanovski Dominators. Usually only supposed to be one auto a box, so that was a bonus. Islam Base Card, Men's Lightweight Division. Silver Hollow for the Women's Bantamweight Division, Juliana Pena. That's a Patty Pim. Lighted up, Kamara Usman. Bone Jones. Blue Hollow, Andre Petrowski for the Men's Middleweight Division. 41 of 49, Rising Suns Insert. And that's a Blue Hollow Parallel, number to 49. Rising Suns, Dominators, Silver Hollow, GSP for the men's middleweight division. Rising Suns, Mainon, Furat. Nice Red Hollow, Shavkat for the men's welterweight division. 167 out of 199, Shavkat, Rachmana. Silver Hollow of Marab for the men's bantamweight division. Silver Hollow, Josh Barnett for the men's heavyweight division. And a lighted up Hamzat. We'll close out box one. Box two coming up. Chargers gone in NT College. Five teams left. Box two. Blue Hollow Kevin Lee for the men's lightweight division. 27 of 99 Kevin Lee. A Randy Brown rated rookie auto prospect Randy Brown for the men's welterweight division. Men's Walter Waite, DG Cool, Randy Brown rated rookie auto. Light it up, Sugar Sean. Light it up, Derek Lewis, Black Beast. Dan Mergliata, you, um, ref card. We're going to do a random at the end of the break for all the ref cards or non MLB M MMA fighter cards. Tala Santos, Silver Hollow for the women's flyweight division. Shavka, Rising Suns. Joe Pfeiffer, rated rookie. Silver Hollow, Macy Barber for the women's flyweight division. My house, remember the name. 
Silver Hollow rated rookie, Draco Claus for the lightweight division. Draco Claus. Light it up, Charles Oliveira. Silver Hollow Uriah Faber for the men's bantamweight division. Dominators, Izzy Adesanya. Mohamed Mokoff rated rookie Blue Hollow for the men's flyweight division. Five of 99, Blue Hollow. Volkanovski Silver Hollow for the women's featherweight division, or men's featherweight division, men's featherweight champion. Rising Suns, Bo Nickel. Red Derek Lewis, Black Beast. That is a 44-199 Red Hollow. Tasuro, men's flyweight division, Rising Suns. Silver Hollow, woman strawweight, Tisha Torres. And a auto red optographs, Piotr Yan for the men's bantamweight division. Piotr, 21 out of 199. Men's bantamweight division. Moxer, another box with a bonus auto. And that's a blue hollow lighted up of Alexa Grasso for the women's flyweight division. 37 out of 49. Lighted up blue. That looks tight with the blue. All right, box three coming up. Angels gone from Breakers Delight. Only 12 teams left in Breakers Delight. Full case of Breakers Delight. Tops Chrome update. Uh, we got the Mets gone from the triple case. 16 teams left in the triple case of Museum. So we're just about halfway sold for that triple case. Good luck to uh, Larry grabbing the Mets in that triple case. By the way, guys, I think this is it. So not only is this obviously our last. Oh, this is a nice parallel. Congrats, men's bantamweight division. 62 of 99 blue hollow rookie Paul Rosas men's bantamweight. So I was gonna say, um, men's bantamweight Moxer, nice Raider rookie blue. I was gonna say, not only is this, is this our last four boxes of Optic UFC, I don't know if you guys noticed or know, but um, oh, that's a gold Jalton Almeida, nine out of ten gold hollow rated rookie, right, right next to that Paul Rosas. Damn, that's crazy. Men's heavyweight division. Men's heavyweight division. Red Juan, nice gold. Congrats, Red Juan. In your face, Ron. Red Juan gets hits even in UFC. What's up? Nine out of ten. Um, so UFC, not UFC. WWE and Panini just d settled their lawsuit. So I don't think there's gonna be any more WWE products from Panini. They just settled their lawsuit. That obviously there's um, not obviously, but I guess there's no details coming from their what the, what their settlement was. But I don't think there's going to be any more WWE Panini products, and that also means we're probably not going to have any more Panini UFC products because UFC and M and WWE are the same company now. So this might not on this might not be just the last four boxes of Optic UFC that we do. This might be the last. UFC Panini break we ever do until maybe Tops get the gets the license back. You're welcome, Rowan. Hopefully it does mean that um, Panini can still come out with products, but right now it seems like there's going to be no more WWE Panini products, which also probably means there's no more UFC products because they're the same company, like I said. They are the same company now. <clears throat> All right. My house, Jan Bukovic, light heavyweight. 
That's uh, Negu Moran Moriano. Damn, he has a hell of a long his name. Negu Moriani Moriano. Silver Hollow Michael Chandler for the lightweight division, men's lightweight division. Light it up, Yang Yi Yang Lee. Silver Hollow Montel Jackson Raider rookie. Silver Hollow Gilbert Burns, Dorino. Mark Goddard, UFC vet, uh, UFC ref auto. All right, we'll randomize the Mark Goddard between the three division or between the eleven divisions at the end of the at the end of the box. Set up that random real quick here. Light it up, Jotun Ameda. Red Johnny Bones Jones, also for the men's heavyweight division, fifty-five ninety-nine. Red Hollow John Jones, red one. Silver Hollow Gamma for the lightweight division. Sean Brady Rising Suns Black Pandora for the men's bantamweight division. John Castaneda Black Pandora Hollow. These are not numbered, but probably for sure short print. Men's Bantamweight Division, Men's Bantamweight Monster, Frank Mia, Marvin Vittori, Silver Hollow, Yair Rodriguez, Men's Featherweight Division, Joe Pfeiffer, Rising Suns, My House, Dustin Poirier, Cyril Gain for the Men's Heavyweight Division, Cyril Gunn, Light It Up, Josh Barnett, Orange Hollow of Islam, Makachev, 28 of 49 in the Orange Hollow for the men's lightweight division. Oh, a redemption auto. Carlos Yolberg, Yolberg base rated rookies, hollow signatures. Carlos Yolberg. Let me see what division Yolberg goes to. Carlos Yolberg, light heavyweight division. Light heavyweight, Carlos Yolberg, light heavyweight. And the light heavyweight division in the break is George T. Light heavyweights. Yep. So you know it's a complicated story, but it's basically another thing that's like it's like fanatics versus Panini. It's it comes from that. So Panini had the Panini signed WWE to an exclusive license. What was it like? Only like a year and a half ago, right? They got the WWE license. When once Tops let go of the WWE license, they didn't want to renew. WWE went to Panini and was like, Yo, okay, let's make a deal. So they signed a three year deal. And then literally three months after Panini um signed the deal with WWE, Fanatics decided they still want WWE. So they signed they they're like, Okay, we get we're gonna sign WWE once the deal with Panini is done. Like literally they literally announced it like three months after Panini and WWE made a deal. Even before the first product came out, Fanatics made it known that they, they're getting the license back. And then so um, you know, probably from pressure, I'm assuming maybe from tops and fanatics is why WWE, they sent the, like a cease, cease and desist to Panini that they didn't want them to make their cards anymore, even though they still had another two years on their deal. All right, we're going to randomize nine times for the Mark Goddard auto. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Women's straw weight division will get that nine times. Women's straw weight. All right, women's straw weight. Straw weight will get the get the mark on her. Here we go, last box, everybody good luck. 
Mets gone from museum collection PYT number 10 half case. Breakers Delight Astros gone. 11 left from Breakers Delight. Cowboys gone from NT College. Four teams left. Anyways, they just, I guess, apparently came to some type of settlement, but there's no details on the settlement. There's actually a guy on Twitter, X, we mention him on the podcast every time we talk about the Panini Fanatic stuff. We mention him on the podcast. There's a guy on Twitter or X. He's like a lawyer. He basically breaks down everything. Uh, and he So he's a lawyer. I believe he's a lawyer. But um, he breaks down all the, like, the legal stuff that happens in the sports card industry as well. It's like his side thing. He literally breaks down everything that happens in, with sports cards on the legal side of the of any court dealings. Forget forget what his name is, but we talk about him on the podcast. Oh, we um, reference him on the podcast. All right, Silver Hollow, Misha Tate, Women's Bantamweight Division. Let's start the last box. My House, Rosanama Yunus, Silver Hollow, Carlos Yulberg, Light Heavyweight, Raider Rookie. Just got his auto. Light it up, Alexa Grasso. Red Hollow, John Castaneda to go with your um, Black Pandora, Raider Rookie Red. 148 to 199, Men's Bantamweight Division. Light it up, Peter Yawn. Sugar Sean O'Malley, Silver Hollow for the men's bantamweight division. Blue Gilbert Burns, Blue Hollow Gilbert Burns, 63 of 99. And a Charles Oliveira, Aqua Hollow Auto for the men's lightweight division. 15 out of 25, Aqua Hollow, men's lightweight. Men's lightweight division, George T. My House of Anthony Hernandez, Silver Hollow Ken Shamrock for the Men's Light Heavyweight Division. My House Sugar Sean O'Malley. Red Alexander Portoya for the Men's Flyweight Division, 139 to 199. Silver Hollow Rated Rookie Auto Marina Godinas Gonzalez, Women's Strawweight. Women's Strawweight. DG Cool. Silver Hollow Auto. Light it up, Amanda Nunez. Silver Hollow, Grant Dawson. Rising Suns. Last stack, we have a Orange Hollow, Maynon, for the Women's Flyweight Division, 33 out of 49. And a Silver Hollow, Frank Mir, for the Men's Heavyweight Division. All right, that is going to close it out, everybody. Our last four boxes of brand-new 2023 Panini Donruss Optic UFC Hobby. That was Random Weight Divisions number 7 for Sunday night, November 26, 2023. All right, let's do one more quick random. I think we only got one ref card, so this is going to be literally for one ref base card. But let's do go ahead and randomize it. We're going to randomize all your divisions nine more times. Top division after nine, we'll get the single base ref card that we got. Or if I, if I missed one, it'll get... This division will win all of the non-fighter base cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. All right. All the non-MMA fighter base cards will go to the women's or men's flyweight division. Nine times in the random. Men's flyweight. Okay. 
Here's our remaining schedule for tonight. Everything is getting super close to filling up. There's the NT case and the two boxes for NT basketball. Ray's gone from museum collection number 10. Nine teams left. What? How are the Lions still one of the last teams? Literally the best team to get. Two rookies that people are chasing. All right, those last four teams in NT College. I just put another discount on those last four, including those Lions. I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> Lions usually sell for two hundred plus on those. Um, all right, yeah, just discount the last four in NT football. That should sell out any moment. Down, 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 All right, I also just put a discount on the last 13 teams in National Treasures basketball again. Another discount on the last 13 teams in NT basketball. There's a link for NT basketball, and here's the link for NT football. Let's fill both them joints up. <laughs> 